Lovids, it's your girl Clemence Wine from Big Empress Energy. I'm sending you beautiful, bountiful blessings. We open to receiving them. Mm -mm -mm. Mis amores, it's your girl Clemence Wine. I record energy and people to fill ochre, and this is our spirit sea. We're gonna find out what our angels, our ancestors, and our guys want us to know right now. Ochre. Now, Mira, if this reading resonates with you, please comment. Okay, let's read the comments. You can also tip it my cash app, buy me a coffee. I appreciate the energy exchange and if you would like to go deep, go to Big Empress Energy LLC.com okay, and secure your spot, okay, for the new moon, new me, collect the candle Reiki. We're doing a higher self activation. We're calling upon our highest and our best, okay, this energy that we are ready to release so we can come up and step into our best energy, okay? Now, mira, if that's something that you're interested in, it is $12.12 with your full name, okay? This is the new moon and full moon. I always do the collective candle reikis, okay? So wherever you are, as long as you participate, you are able to receive this energy healing remotely. If that's something that you're interested in, definitely check out different posts about it if it's your first time to get information on collective candle reiki okay oh, and you could also book a reading on my website big empress energy llc.com okay oh, now let's get into it let's see what we need to know right now what messages our spirit guides angels and ancestors have for us what we need to know right now every single body watching this video spirit, what does every single body need to know right now everybody watching this video what is the message for the people spirit Mm. shine shine bright okay shine shine bright i'm seeing like the sun i'm seeing um like yellow yellow type of energy okay so i feel like this is also sp spirit saying like okay honestly this is it you're taking a lot of things way too seriously okay have fun have fun in the process Okay, allow yourself to have joy. Do not beat yourself up like, oh my God, I gotta do this, I gotta do this, I haven't had time, I haven't had time. Because it's almost this energy of you have all the time that you need, okay? Time is an illusion. Take right now, okay? Take right now and do something that your future self will thank you for, okay? Also feeling like, some people are allowing themselves to be seen, okay? You're allowing yourself to be seen. You're allowing yourself to be vulnerable. You may be saying things you normally would keep to yourself. And this is good. This is growth, okay? Because you don't need to keep everything inside, okay? Another message I'm getting for you guys um, is that at this point, you are kind of, I feel like I'm seeing someone at the top of the mountain, okay? At the top of the mountain, they've reached their goals, okay? So, if you knew you was going to be successful, you knew you are going to reach your goals eventually, what would you do right now? What I'm getting is a lot of you stressing yourself out, okay? A lot of your, you're stressing yourself out in your mind. You're making a situation bigger than it is. It doesn't need to be that seriously. It's literally, it's YOLO effort at this point, okay? YOLO effort. It's like, you're going to make it there. You're going to get to the top of the mountain. You are going to accomplish what it is that you want to do, okay? You are going to ascend. You are going to release. You are going to progress. But it's like, there's no rush to it, okay? There's no rush to it. We're not rushing to your final form, okay? So wherever you are right now, just take a big, deep, big, deep breath. Okay, spirits also want to take really, really deep breaths to help you to move through your energy, to move through your emotions, okay? Hmm. Y'all getting too, 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 too in your own head about everything, okay? Like, it's not working out the way that you have wanted it to. I'm seeing the seven of pentacles in the reverse and the ten of wands. Y'all taking on too much. That's what I'm saying. Y'all being too hard on yourself, okay? To this point where you need to ask somebody for help. You need to... um kind of like reorganize, revamp the situation, okay? I feel like you guys are going back and forth with something. And you know what? You've been carrying way too much. What can you put down? What can you ask someone to do for you? How can you be open to receive help because you are worth it? Because you don't have to work yourself down to the very bone, okay? To prove your worth. I'm seeing that there could be a new opportunity coming to you, something you've been waiting a long time for, but you don't even have the space on your plate. You don't even have the time of day because your too, energy is too freight, okay? Um, it's everywhere. It's scattered, okay? So with this energy, it's time to release these old cycles of I got to do everything. I'm a control freak. Nobody's going to do it like me, okay? Spirit is saying, like, this is not working for you. At this point, with all these reversals, you're needing to go with 
in, okay? There's something that you're wanting to say yes to, something that you're wanting to add on to, something that you're wanting to do, revamp, but you're going back and forth, okay? And you're having to, Spirit wants you to make this decision based on how it feels in your body, okay? Does it feel like whatever this is is going to be liberating you? It's going to create space in your body? It's going to allow you to breathe more deeply? Then yes, that's how you know it is for you. If it's going to be causing you more stress, sleepless nights, and something you're going to be more hard on yourself, that's how you know it's not exactly for you, okay? Um, hmm. I feel like some of y'all need to take a leap of faith, leap of faith, and then in two to three weeks, it's going to be paying off for you, okay? So it's going to actually be a very rapid turnover, a very rapid turnover I'm seeing with this. Um... Okay, some of you guys are so stubborn, okay, Spirit's saying that you won't even open yourself up. You're like, it's to the point where if you don't take that break, if you don't let yourself rest as hard as you work, Spirit's going to make you, okay? There's going to be some sort of external factor that's going to be pushing you to listen to your body, to honor your body, to honor your energy. So make sure you're doing that right now. We only have wands and pentacles. This is fire and earth, okay? So what are we doing on earth? And this is reminding me too of that Mars retrograde period so we're, we're reviewing all of our actions all of the things that we've been putting our energy attention and drive into there's a fruit there's a carrot there's something that's on the we've been putting it on the back burner for this whole entire year something that you really wanted to do something you really wanted to say yes to you've been putting it on the back burner this entire year okay going back and forth going back and forth when you know that you've been working harder this whole time when you know that there is a better option okay but as some point it's like you don't even you're not even letting yourself see it okay so there's a lot of things that are not almost as they seem okay a lot of things not as they seem but we do have the magician card with that spirit wants you to know how powerful your words are okay the power of your words it could bring blessings it could bring blocks okay so make sure that you're keeping your words very positive your thoughts very positive with this magician energy as above so below you have all the resources that you need at this time the only um thing I see holding you back is your mind. We have the Knight of Wands in the reverse. The mind is holding you back because you're wanting to rush a mile a minute, okay? But you cannot rush what is for you, and you cannot miss it either, boo. So you, it, it's like one of those things, like I'm telling you, like you have the time. You have the time. You're going to get to the top of the mountain. You have the, magi you have the magician. You have the power. What I'm also seeing is the magician, one, the two of pentacles, and the three of wands. That's one, two, and three, baby, okay? So you might be seeing that angel number a lot. And this is talking about how you cannot rush steps. You cannot be so inspired and then rush and rush and rush and think you're going to be an expert in your field. You cannot compare yourself to on your day one journey to someone who's been in the game for 10 years. You cannot. You cannot. You have to trust, though, in divine timing. You have to trust that at the specific time that you start, you will be... It's almost sometimes it's feeling of an acceleration, okay, um, because it's in alignment for you. If, if something is in alignment for you, you will have an accelerated amount of growth or um, accomplishments that can happen in a small amount of time. We have pleasure seekers and thoughts. What I'm seeing from this is you're thinking too much. You are thinking about something way too much to the point where you're creating a bigger problem than it is, okay? Like I said, don't take us so seriously. We have pleasure seekers. Spirit is saying to seek pleasure okay it's it's okay to feel good damn it you deserve to feel good you deserve to feel special you deserve to feel like an empress you deserve to feel like a powerful ass magician you deserve to know how powerful and potent your mind is your words are and it feels like with this energy to say yes to go after what gives you pleasure to seek that joy and in that on on that road you're gonna reach the, um, the destination that you've been calling for okay not a moment before though <clears throat> not a moment before okay so like i say like you cannot rush you cannot rush you cannot rush okay so some of the blocks that we have <laughs> some of us are needing to cut out something okay and these things are i feel like are negative thoughts cut out something that like maybe an action that you do a commitment that you have snip 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 you're overextending yourself i don't know how many times i tell you you overextending yourself cut there's something you need to cut out 
okay? Some of y'all spirits think it's your nasty ass attitude and, 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 and always thinking that somebody else is doing better than you. That's why you upset with your own fruits. That's why you so unsatisfied with your progress because you're so busy looking at somebody else thinking they have it better than you, okay? But we have trash magic, okay? That means you can make something from anything. The magic, the magician, this is a very magical Monday, a very magical moon day, okay? So what you need to know is that you can create from crumbs. You can create from crumbs, okay? And then we have reset and same, same, but different. So I see a lot of y'all need to take a break, okay? And, and I saw one, two, three on the clock. A lot of y'all need to take a break, okay? Because you have been working so hard and you need to work inspired. You need to work uh, with divine, okay? You need to work in alignment. And then same, same, but different. What I'm getting from this is that Yo, you think that you is just on the same level as somebody else, but y'all different. That's why you have different blessings. That's why you're on different paths. Woo, okay? So again, do not compare yourself to somebody else. And then we have tried the opposite, okay? So this is amazing. This is very much on par with the seven of pentacles, seven, ten of wands, which is like something that you've been doing is exhausting you. It's not making you happy. Try the opposite. Try something different. Try to work smarter, not harder, okay? Try the opposite. If something's not, not working for you, maybe this is a sign to do something else, to say yes to something else. I already know that y'all know what I'm talking about, okay? Y'all already know what I'm talking about. So um, try something different. Try something different. Okay, so what we have is bronze, strengthen your body. Some of you guys might be wanting to exercise, do something physical, okay? I feel like also with this energy, um, rewards, you will be reaping rewards when you take risks. We also have purple, okay? Now, purple says develop mental clarity, all right? So at this time, you're needing to focus on the third eye or crown chakra, the amount of ab the ability that you're having to see something as it truly is, okay? And we have peach, inhale a breath of light okay like i said spirits want you to take very very deep breaths okay very deep breaths to create spaciousness in your body so you can pay attention to the signals your body is sending you no we're done with this here or yes we we're called to do something else okay um with this energy as well purple could be very healing for you okay so you might want to hold on to a purple crystal now it's that time my love ask a question ask a question like a yes or no type of question <laughs> Gag, gag. Spirit said, don't waste your time, okay? Don't waste your time. You've been wasting your time toiling over something that is not working. Put it down and start again, okay? Don't waste your time. And Spirit's also like, damn, don't even waste my time, okay? Because I'm tired. Because <laughs> we tired, fam. Because we tired. That's the message, okay? That's a whole message. So we have turquoise over here, balance, okay? So maybe an iolite, freedom, okay? So these are some crystals that have a message for us. Turquoise is going to help you to be on the most high vibration that you can be, okay? So... And with this energy, I feel like it's balancing your actions, balancing your actions. You don't always have to do, 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 do. Some of y'all are do, 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 doing too much, okay? Y'all doing too much. That's why we got the be still card, okay? You need to meditate. Make sure that you are connecting with spirit, okay? Um, what I'm getting from this is like, you're looking for direction. You're looking for clarity. You're looking for answers. See how it feels in your body. Create that breath, that stillness, and then see how your body, what kind of signals your body is giving you. Okay. Some of you guys are going to have thoughts pop into your head and those are divine thoughts. We also have look for fairies with this energy of look for fairies. What you need to know is that it's okay to play. There's a lot of enchantment happening. There's a lot happening behind the scenes. Okay. That maybe you are not, um, you are not allowing yourself to see. Okay. So believe in, like, it's like believe in fairies, believe in magic. That's actually this energy. Wow. So we have leap of faith and Yamaya golden opportunity and I leap of faith. So some of you guys need to take a leap of faith. That's going to, a door is going to be opening. You got to take that leap of faith. Trust yourself. It says take a risk and put your heart's true desire into action. And then this is confirmation, our cura blossoming. You are just getting started. So have patience with yourself 
end the process and do not give up. Okay. Yes, mi amores. If this reading resonates with you, please call me and holla at your girl. You could also tip in my cash app, buy me a coffee. I appreciate the energy exchange. You have a couple more days to secure your spot for the new moon, new me, high yourself activation collective candle Reiki at my website, Big Empress Energy LLC.com.